in the image of Elohim the Creator. How come we were created in the image of Elohim and later Elohim saw that the wickedness of man was great in the earth and that every imagination of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continually, Genesis 6 5. This is indeed the key for understanding of all human behavior and world events. We must understand what our soul and spirit. Soul was created on the fifth day. That tells us that animals that have souls are not related to the form of life that existed in the initial earth that was destroyed and covered with water. Adam's soul was made on the sixth day because it was already existed from the day before and his body was formed. Then his spirit was created in the image of Elohim. Adam indeed died on the day he ate from the forbidden tree. That death was the loss of his spirit. We stopped being in the image of Elohim. The loss of Adam's spirit formed a vacuum in which the Satan quickly planted his spirit. That is the spirit that many spiritual gurus are tempting us to develop. It is this spirit that limits our loving and wishes levels. Humans stopped being in the image of Elohim and became under the, and every imagination of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continually, Genesis 6 5. The more we develop Satan's spirits, the more we become wrong. We fail to see this because our logic in each one is different, boosts our egos and confidence as if we are correct. Our world is doomed because our potential and loving abilities are limited. Elohim will not allow this situation to remain forever. That is the reason that it was him, not the Satan, that threw Adam out of the garden and prevented him from eating from the fruit of eternal life. Divided the world in order to prevent us from uniting. Doesn't Elohim wants us to have eternal life and live united in peace? Of course he does. But only on the right terms. Until then there is a spiritual war with the Satan who wishes to provide us compromised kingdom on his standards. He will fail. The big questions is whatever the soul is in control and the spirit is just advisor that tries to tempt us and give us bad advice or does the spirit controls human souls and enslaves it. Read more details in the book, The Love of Elohim and the World's Meaningless Love, at www.patreon.com slash 8 k one